All right, guys, it is time. Put a little filter on the phone. These little bad boys have been floating for about half an hour. And then I put them in here. I usually drip acclimate as well, but what I did, I just uh, took my salinity checker and kept pouring water into the little bucket. Um, just because a dripper would take too long. Um, they've been floating. The salinity at the pet shop is at the LFS is usually pretty much the same. My Harlequin are actually over here. You get a little glimpse of them. My little pair. And yes, I do have some algae sand issue. And this one just got himself a little starfish. for maybe a couple months now so we're doing good had some Yuma so a lot of my Yumas are doing well this is just a random vlog fish video but um, had some Yumas on this rock and this rock and they perished but all the other ones are flourishing, popping out a baby. These are going crazy. The recordias are doing crazy. So I'm not sure if it's just still newer tank syndrome, even though it's my old rocks and everything. Got my little shroom garden here. My new little St. Thomas. Next to that big boy. All right, so let's let these bad boys in. Let me catch them, and then I'll get you guys back on video. And they are in the Midas Blenny. It's actually feeling kind of comfortable. So that's a good thing. Yellow coarse wrasse is somewhere under this rock down here. Of course, you won't be able to see it. And the algae blenny is propped up on this rock with some algae. But yeah, guys, um, do have this diatom. Maybe it's a little cyano bloom going on. So I'm going to try to get some sand sifter to help that out. Not sure if I should get another power head. Got one over here and I got a gyre over here. So I don't know if I need something pointing towards the bottom. Maybe I have too much top flow agitation, not enough bottom. Well, that's kind of the new additions uh, to the tank. Let me know what you guys think. I'm going to feed the fish in a little bit, turn off the whites or turn them down. Got them kind of uh, a little bright here just so the camera picks it up. Other than that, guys, leave me some comments. Let me know what you think. Pointers, suggestions, whatnot. Holla. All right, guys, just kidding. One more fish haul. So after that one, about a week later, I went and got my fox face again, as you can see that. Um, doing pretty well. The yellow coarse wrasse is coming out, doing really good, eating like a champ. And I got one more fish, and that would be the copper band butterfly. I know they're kind of hard to keep, he pretty much ate most of my feather dusters already. Uh, he ate at the LFS. He eats maybe a couple mices here and there when I feed the fish. So hopefully he's going to make it. The only thing is, Zoas are being eaten. So I don't know if it's him or the fox face. If you guys know or have had experience, let me know in the comments. My Harlequin walking around. But that's about it. So hopefully that's the last fish haul. Maybe get a tang down the road. But for now, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.